2017 Suzuki V-Strom 650 and 650 XT2017 Suzuki V-Strom 650 XT fully outfitted with a host of accessories that are now shared by the V-Strom 650 in 1000 models, coinciding with the announcement of a pair. A fresh liter class Suzuki V-Stroms comes the ADV-inspired V-Strom 650 and V-Strom 650XT models. Unlike the comparatively moderate revisions given its larger sibling, these middleweight Stroms have received a multitude of performance and styling updates that qualify them as something just shy of an all-new platform. 2017 Suzuki V-Strom 650XT fitted with accessory, protective crash bar and LED fog lamps. The handguards are a standard item on the XT model, topping the list is an updated powertrain that adopts the same 645cc liquid-cooled V-twin that served as the centerpiece of the new for 2016 SV650. Perhaps the biggest news here is the inclusion of traction control allowing the rider a choice of two levels of intervention along with the ability to override the system. In addition to improved low to mid-range power and tractability comes the convenience of Suzuki Easy Start system in which engine startup will now only require a momentary one push of the starter button. Another recent SV-derived feature is low RPM assist that helps avoid stalling the motor when pulling away from a standing stop. It's a pretty slick feature that raises idle RPM when the bike is in gear and the clutch is engaged. I first noticed this feature on the GSX-S1000. Although Suzuki strangely never mentioned it when that model was introduced in the fall of 2015, on the chassis front is the same twin spar alloy main frame as its predecessor now mated to a new subframe and slimmer, lower exhaust muffler patterned after that of the V-Strom 1000, which has in turn allowed standardization of the accessory hard bags and the more that are now interchangeable across the V-Strom family. Both V-Strom 650 versions get new wheels with lighter 10-spoke cast hoops on the standard model and did tubeless spoke rims on the XT. Both wheel options come equipped with Bridgestone Battleax Adventure A40 radials in 110/80th SR19 front and 150/70th SR17 rear sizes, said to have been developed for this model to realize high on-road capabilities. Stability and durability, the all-new styling is also in line with its larger capacity sibling adopting the prominent beak paying homage to Suzuki's rally racing heritage and the Dr. Z Desert Racer and Dr. Big production bike so Dior. The windscreen is three-way adjustable in height, although unlike larger sibling does require tools to alter while maintaining previous fuel capacity. The revised 4.4 GAL and tank is slimmer in the rear that in conjunction with new plastic side covers makes for an easier reach to the ground. The seat now offers more padding and a grippier cover, a new dash cluster borrowed from the V-Strom 1000 features an analog tachometer combined with a host of LCD display functions. The rider is able to select information on the LCD display or choose a TC setting utilizing a switch located on the left handlebar. The dash also now includes a 12 VDC lighter type outlet for powering electronic accessories. Unique to the V-Strom 650XT are handguards and the engine under cowling, not a skid plate. Adding to the adventure bike appearance, the instrument panel has also been updated to the functional unit of the V-Strom 1000. The instruments include an analog tachometer and a brightness adjustable LCD speedometer. Newly designed LCD readouts include an odometer, dual trip meters, gear position coolant and air temperatures, battery voltage, range on remaining fuel, average fuel consumption, instantaneous fuel consumption, traction control mode, a fuel gauge and clock. LED indicators included an interesting freeze indicator that starts blinking when the ambient temperature falls below 37 degrees Fahrenheit. 
It continues to blink for 30 seconds then remains lit until the ambient temperature rises above 41 degrees Fahrenheit. Stacked headlight unit like that of the V-Strong 1000 keeps the low beam lit when on high beam to provide a broad illuminated area.